Mario Bros. 3 is overdone. Okay. Well, let's see what the chat says. Well, uh, suck my dick. I want to do it. <laughs> <laughs> no, get well, AI to do it. Get AI to do that. No, thanks. <laughs> I asked for you specifically. So, uh, you either get down or get me a fucking stepladder. One of the two. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Jesus! First, I have to find someone named Richard, though. Excuse Richard's here. I, uh... <laughs> Fuck! Ugh. Ask Bliss, have you ever played Fortnite? Nope. Nope. Have we ever played Fork Knife? <laughs> you know, it's funny. I've actually played Fortnite, but in the mode that it was originally supposed to be. You know, the one where you're actually supposed to build stuff to kill zombies. Yeah. I've also played the Battle Royale mode, but I don't play a whole lot of Battle Royale games. Battle Royale is already just oversaturated, just like zombies. As soon as fucking yeah no, it, it, it's been getting that way ever since fucking like PUBG did uh well they didn't do the original because you know fucking H1Z1 and all those others were already a thing but like I feel like they were the one of the first ones to actually get it really popular and then afterwards everyone was like oh you know what this is really fucking cool we should all do it too and then you know it happened. And now fucking the new Call of Duty is ditching literally a single player mode so they can have Battle Royale. You said duty. Well, yeah, exactly. Well, you that's were the chosen for you. one. <laughs> Somebody's having a bad time. <laughs> Do you hear this? Yeah. <laughs> what are you crazy kids up to? Call of shitty. <laughs> Thoughts about the E3? Um. Didn't know one because they actually showed games and didn't bullshit us over anything. I can't say too much. Like, I am aware that um, there's a uh, there's another Smash Brothers game, and everybody is brought back. Yes. Like that sounds exciting. I still hate Jigglypuff. Swine. Jigglypuff. I'm just so excited that they decided to bring back fucking. They brought back Snake. And that makes me happy. What's the surveillance camera? Oh shit! Oh, I got hit by a fucking fish. You know what I'm hoping for finally happens with the release of new this new Smash Brothers? What's that? Hmm. And the melee finally dies. What about melee? What's wrong with competitive melee? Because it's not actually competitive because they're actually just exploiting bugs as that in order to actually make a competitive game. Hmm. That and they're the most I, and that I and melee, I feel like that and melee pros are like some of the most like entirely obnoxious gamers you'll ever meet. Hmm. I don't know. I feel like fucking any game can be competitive as long as you have people that want to play it. I mean that's like that, that, that's like saying that fucking you know people that do speed runs don't actually play video games because they just exploit bugs in order to get the best time. Well, like, here's the thing though: would you really want? Would you really consider like a high end tournament? To, imagine any other game where like they had to like break the mechanics of the game in order it for be like worldwide competitive tournament thing. Like no other game I know of does that. And I'm just saying that because of how long it is, but like. Even if I discount that, Melee's just had its time. I think it's time to move on. I mean, the reason that Melee was... is, like, the go-to competitive Smash game, because there there are other 
Smash games in the past have been competitive. There's been shit like Smash 64 fucking combo tourneys, and there's, you know, Smash 4. There's fucking people have basically played every itera iteration of Smash competitively. But I believe the reason why Melee is the go-to one is because fucking they, uh, is just because of the speed. That That's the main reason that people like it is because you can do all this stuff and it doesn't feel like you're being artificially slowed down. It's just basically down to the hill. You got foot. Foot's good. Foot, foot. Foot, foot. 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 I get foot. Uh, food, indeed. Do not make me hungry. I'm actually kind of strapped on cash. Oh, God, that sucks. I, I know the feeling. I prefer to... Make my food. Well, I don't have really have anything to even make food, so. Uh. Look, that I'm gonna move on from that, so. Yeah. Uh... Oh damn it! I missed it. All right. Okay. And up here. Oh no! Oh god! By the way, people are bringing up the rate Wii U. Am I the only one who still kind of wants one for some of the games on there, like Wonderful One to One? Well, uh, to be to, to be to, te to tell you the truth, um, I still want to like, I still want to have like every Nintendo console. Oh yeah, so do I. <laughs> in, in, in yes, I also mean the Virtual Boy as well. Oh why? So you can go blind. <laughs> No, I'm just curious and like trying the console out. Like, it does it really cause that many seizures and You're shit? You're curious about blindness? Similarly, I want to actually play Star Fox Zero just to see if the controls are that bad or if people are just really overblowing it. You hmm. want to test to see how uncomfortable it is? Gotcha. <laughs> actually, believe it or not. Okay, I can hear myself. I can too. Yes. Every now and then. Yeah, I hear an echo. Echo. But no, um. The uh, Virtual Boy, it actually has a bit of a small following. Why? <laughs> they just do. Five people. Because some people like Torment. Why do you think I play Dark Souls? There's a reason the term masochism exists. <laughs> yeah, we can just ask Peter. He's here. <laughs> he's uh, He's currently meditating. Oh, 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 sorry, Magic Star Flash. I will grab the link for Golden. Oh, uh, another link, huh? Yeah, hold on. It's loading for me. Okay. Another link, yeah. I will By the way, uh, until you're a brony ass, gold, you, Golden Fox, aside from games, any cartoons or movies you're interested in? Um, have, have you met this guy ever? Yeah, no, I'm a, I'm a big fan <laughs> of Disney animation. Um, I don't know how to answer that question because when you're saying cartoons... Uh, do you mean cartoon shows, uh, movies, or what? There's a lot of things cartoon. Yeah, there's a lot of various factors. No, I posted in the Discord. Okay. All right, let's take a look at this. Oh wait. All right, so let's put this. Damn, that's quite a cake. That's a big cake. It's yeah, like a, there's a, it, it has, has like to a be a big cake in order to hide a stripper in it. <laughs> <laughs> the stripper's a young. No, the, the stripper is keyframe, obviously. That's why it's so tall. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> tall horse. Yeah, exactly. A giraffe horse. Oh. Well, I just hope you make sure to actually bake the cake after. I mean, before you put the strip yeah, in it. Yeah. Oh my god, shut up. Why would you sit... That doesn't make any sense. What, are they just gonna sit in the fucking batter while you put them in the oven? No, that was a Futurama reference. That's retarded. <laughs> Done. <laughs> Oh, god damn it. <laughs> Stripper and a cake. 
See, I, w I got sent to jail once because I ate an entire birthday cake, and that was before I re that's before I realized there was a stripper inside of it. God damn, some of these enemies are like, they're falling like they're walking on the moon. Ask Golden Fox, dear Golden Fox, do you remember playing Paper Mario on 64? I had never played Paper Mario. Paper Mario okay. was a good game. Okay, as, as oh man, that, that as, was one of the games of my childhood as, that I didn't even know. As as much of a fan I am with Mario, I haven't played any of the RPG uh, Mario games. You need to play the OG Mario RPG. Oh yeah, that's... no, that's that's my milestone uh, when I reach uh, when my channel reaches 1,000 subs. It's so good. Oh yeah, here's the order I recommend: the original OG, followed by um, uh, Superstar Saga. Mm -hmm. Then Paper Mario, then Thousand Year Door, then Super, that Mar one. Super Paper Mario. Then I don't exactly recommend the other ones from there. That, well, if, if we go back to partners, if we go back to the Mario and Luigi after, <laughs> maybe after you do Paper oh. Mario, you try Partners in Time, and then um, oh, what's it called Bowser's Inside Story. I remember Dream Team was really good. I never got to play that one. I actually. Oh, played. Dream Team was so good. <laughs> Dude, Dream the... Team makes fucking Luigi a yeah, badass. Like no joke, he becomes a legit fucking badass. Well, in that considering game. that in the in those RPG games they use mallets, that definitely shows that you really shouldn't fuck with Mario and Luigi. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, okay, I haven't played the games, but I know of its gameplay, and they have some gaming mechanics where they use a mallet, and they, like, stack on top of each other and shit. Like, it's crazy. Oh, yeah. No, the, the, the attacks get really fucking wacky. <laughs> but I think the problem with, like, um, Dream Team Onward is, like, some of the attacks just got way too long, and, like, they made, like, normal attacks just, like, not worth yeah. it. Yeah. Oh, you mean the Ash Bliss, favorite DBZ character. I am stuck between Vegeta and Beerus. <clears throat> there goes Mario. And then one last thing I, I want to say: the thing about the my thoughts on the Paper Mario is that uh, I always thought its plot was a Fuck. paper thin. It was a what? Master code. Uh, Master code. I always thought the. Uh, no. Then. That is far from the truth. <laughs> like I know you were going for a joke, but the joke like just crumbles over the over the actual truth. Funny no, no, joke. That, that's just, that was the funniest funny joke, joke? joke in their lives. I have a joke for you. What? <laughs> what? What kind of car do I drive? A Toyota. Mm. <laughs> Fun to joke. Are you, are you, what are you even what are you doing? Fuck. Freaking kill me. <laughs> that could be arranged to dip by daylight. Yeah. Daylight. I'm tempted, but I can to just gift you the guy the game so I could just so we could play together so I could murder <laughs> you. I mean, play with you guys. So yeah, she we already played Friday the thirteenth with her and she got spooked really bad. <laughs> yeah, uh, it was really bad. I've never played that one, but I'm upset that the game's essentially dead now because of the completely actually dead because of the lawsuit and all that. There's a lawsuit? What? what? Yeah, apparently like the original script writer is like up in arms about the licensing and all that, so like the game devs have like to cease all their development on the game while that's going on. That's essentially killing the game. Uh, well, the game's kind of dead uh, already due to the low population and all that, but yeah, the game's dead. Basically. I remember liking it because it was, uh, they actually got fucking, like, serial killer video games right to where, like, if, you, if you're if you alone, you don't really have a chance. You have to find other people and actually fucking coordinate in order to, in order to win, and that's what and I liked we about have it. Just did by daylight. <laughs> I didn't like the game's controls well they pretty soon we might have death garden it also made by behavior cool. like imagine There's all that with guns and athletic moves <laughs> da, 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 so a serial killer game but with fucking parkour 
Well, it's not really a serial killer game. It's like a death arena game. Hence why it's called Death Garden. Spooky Fox? What? <laughs> Are you referring to you? I guess I'm referring to you. I guess referring to you being all scary or something like that. No, I think somebody was referring to the, um, what is it? The, the little thing that happened during Star Fox. Hmm. Oh! That. Wahahaha. <laughs> 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 no, I, 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 I still think that was absolutely hilarious. <laughs> I'm just like I'm re I'm just I'm just reading the fucking okay so I was uh, streaming Star Fox and I was like minding my own business reading out the dialogue and then all of a sudden like Bliss is in the call and she goes kaboom and I flip back I'm like oh Jesus fuck and she's laughing her ass off afterwards uh, she laughed for like a good like four minutes I think she's still internally keckling to this day. <laughs> <laughs> See, no, by the way, by the way, while on the subject of Star Fox, that's like one of the games I want to go back and finally beat completely. Because no matter how hard I try, like I never get all the medals and then unlock the expert mode in that game. Oh, Star Fox sixty four? <laughs> yeah. Oh um, yeah. My brother was able to do that multiple times. The um, if there's any stage that's a real pain in the ass to get a medal, it's um, I forgot what the stages, but the planet looks like Saturn. It's got the rings. Oh fuck! fuck. Oh, that sounds like Titania, where you have to rescue Slippy. Yeah, that's the one. It's the yeah, one. The, the one I was never able to do actually was the Venom, Venom on the easy on the quote unquote easy path. It's like I just cool. never get enough. You 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 couldn't Guys. get two hundred kills on like the richest enemy environment ever. Because you have to do like the smart bombs and like very specific spots. I think you need three hundred actually. No, it's two hundred. <laughs> S. Golden, are you familiar with the Splatterhouse games? Um, I am. I've never played them. Ah. Yeah, I was gonna say it's 200 because every fucking kill against Star Wolf, and if you do it within a certain time period, is 50 points. And if you kill them all quick enough, you get the medal on hard mode, so it's 200. Oh yeah, points. I was able to get that one easily, but uh, I think yeah. it's because I was just a dumb kid. I hear I an echo again. Played. Yeah, I do. I don't know what it was about Venom, but I never, I got like only up to like 170 or something like that. Maybe because I was just bad at the normal Nova bomb placement. I mean, I was, I, was, I was able to get the medal on like Sector Z though. It's ever, hang on a second. Venom. Go ahead. Ask Golden, have you ever played Tidy Toot Adventures Buster, ba Buster Bust Loose on the SNES? No, I have not. Wasn't that published by Konami? I have no idea. <laughs> it would have to be. Okay, the funny thing is, is that, okay, so back at the time, there was Konami and Capcom who were competitors. They each had, like, the different iconic, like, movie brands. Like, Capcom uh, had the license for Disney, whereas Konami had the license for Warner Brothers. And not to mention, they also had Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Well, now we know. Just an interesting contrast of the two. Ah, uh, oh, no one shot the battle. Ah, oh, shit. Those things are weird to step on. Okay, you know, with Mario standing on top of these pots while, you know, there's fire below them, I mean, don't you think that maybe he would be hot or, like, be hurt from all this? Dude, he hits, he breaks bricks with his hands. I don't think a little heat is gonna, I don't think heat up front until, unless it's an actual fire is gonna bother him. Especially when it's on his shoes, which never seem to wear out ever. I ha I have this feeling that those uh, those shoes are like heat resistant, so he could stand on top of those cauldrons, and just be like, oh, it's, "Well, I imagine they it's a they good would problem. have to be." I, I imagine they would have to be pretty like sturdy, since his his quote unquote job is, you know, he's a fucking plumber, so he's always around pipes, and those pipes might have a bunch of. Steam or some shit like that in him. So. And also considering how high he actually jumps, he must put a lot of pressure on the pressure and force on them when he leaves the ground. Yeah, really fucking the man jumps like what, like six feet in the air straight up. <laughs> oh 
Morty. Excuse <laughs> you. <laughs> You know what this game is making me nostalgic for? The the Wario games. I haven't played... Okay, I played the third and fourth, but I haven't played the uh, the first two. I think I own the first Wario game with, like, where he's on the island with the pirates and all that. Mm. I'm not sure which one it was, but that's the one I own. And I remember that one being decently challenging, too, but I actually beat that one, unlike this one. I can't spell to save my life anymore. Uh, <laughs> what are you trying to spell? Masochism. <laughs> uh, masochism is a bit of a tricky word. Um, Just Peter. No, M A. <laughs> M A S O C H I S M. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. I have the joke of the night. Thank you, Jesus. thank you, thank you, audience. Thank you. Fucking massacre! When did you become like fucking? MC, are you going to Brodicon? Yes. <laughs> I'm gonna give you a big freaking hug. <laughs> Which is probably easy since you're a freaking tree and come up to your chest. <laughs> I mean, you gotta give me a special birthday hug on Saturday. I, I don't even know what to get you for your birthday. Should I just get you a gift card? <laughs> okay, so you can get him a giant need, penis uh, cake. It has to be a hundred dollar gift limit. It has to be a hundred dollars at least. Or if you don't have a hundred dollars, yeah, that's fine. If, or if the like, what the hell is Basco you know, gonna do with a gift uh, card? He's loaded. Cash or I'll uh, take checks. <laughs> Uh, not traveler's checks, but, uh, you know, just regular checks, you know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, I know what I can do. I can buy you a milkshake on me. Fuck. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'll do. I'll buy you a milkshake. A milkshake. Go to Hard Rock Cafe and I'll buy you a milkshake. A milkshake. Oh, milkshake. the Hard Rock Cafe. That was such a fun time. Yeah, that was so good. Good times, good times. Tabs, good tabs. I'm still pissed off you're not going, Golden. Hey, it's not my fault that I can only have one week off, and there's only so much money I can save up. Fuck! Get a better job! Easier said than done. I, thank you, yeah. Amazon Factory! Quick bliss, get him, get him a job now. I wish, right? <laughs> You know what, as soon as I can, like, make sure the internet is stable in my house and I actually find a way to fix the fan, at least probably get a new computer case, I'm gonna try streaming myself. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit! Ah, I went way too ahead. Ooh, checkpoint. Thank you. What?! I did not touch that! That was bullshit! I did not touch her. I did not. It's That's bullshit. bullshit. I... Oh, hi, Golden. Oh, hi, Mark. <laughs> oh, hi, Mario. <laughs> oh, hi, Mark. <laughs> Who saw the disaster artist? Because I did. They made Tommy was so, so sympathetic. It's glorious. Ugh. Okay. Whoa! Jesus, I don't want to hit that spike pit again. Get off, Teddy. Whoa. Nobody likes you. And here's a random question. Is anyone here, like, watching Gordon Ramsay? Yes. Yes. <laughs> it's yes. fucking raw. What the hell it's is this? It's fucking raw, you fucking donkey. Get the fuck out of my sight. What the hell is this? What? Eh? What? Oh my god. Are you serious? It shut okay. off. Uh. Oh. It shut off. Damn it, wrong one. Yeah, no, the emulator, it shut itself off. And that? I know you didn't do it. It was just. I blame Bliss. She said the boom, and that was the kill word. <laughs> I can at, least, at least I can pick up where I last left off. I was about to say, I hope you have like a save state or something like that. <laughs> I'm trying to mimic solar. Oh, this game, this, this game already has like a save uh, battery. 
Oh yeah, now I remember, yeah. Ooh, I'm curious. But it doesn't really you matter if you lose all your lives and then, then like you have to start over. You the only thing you coins. have to if you get game over in Mario 2, you just you have to get the coins back. Which... But for me, but for me and my unskilled child self, that was torture. Yeah, I thought that way too because uh, when it comes to bosses, they take more effort. I, I think like you still have to like um, do the pre penultimate stage before you can try them again. Because I remember like in the space zone, constantly I had to like go through like the avoid. Okay, stars I was able to go through this like choice. nothing. Mimi key key. What? That sounds like a ship what? between Mimi and Keyframe. Oh god. <laughs> hey, that sounds pretty hot. Get out! Get out! <laughs> well, involving those two girls, Good I think call. I'd much rather get in. Oh my god! You son of a <laughs> what? What? Don't involve me. I'm the unshippable guy, so. I'm gonna ask some questions. Ask Blissey. I wanna try going to a Brody convention. Which one is considered easy and cheap? For me to go to. Well, where do you live? That depends on where you live, for sure. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> like, if you're living in a state where there is a convention, you're guaranteed that'll be the best, cheapest call for you to go to because you literally just drive to it. That Everywhere was... else, though, you're more than likely gonna have to fly to it. Yeah. You know, that was uh, oh, Equestria LA for me because it was very close by where I live. That's all the cons for me, except for Nightmare Nights, which is no longer functioning, and, but there is a new con starting up called Harmony Con next year. Harmony Con. Harmony Con. Harmony Con. Highway what? to the Mario oh. Zone. I guess uh, Dead by Daylight's got some special promotion. It's only, <laughs> it's 50% off. It's only $10 now. Ooh. Yeah, I tried telling you about the free weekend about a month ago, but you never looked, looked, looked at that. I'm Could sorry? have played to get it before you buy it. Time it is, Brett Arooney? What? It's past six thirty. Uh, Nanny the fuck. He said he'd be done playing at six, and then I gave him till six thirty, and now it's six forty-five. I want to be able to cook before the sun goes down. Why can't you cook? It makes up a lot of racket, that's why. Alright. Hi, Key. Yeah, I gotta take care of a couple of things. Oh. Yeah, no. But I, we were. Keyframe, we were having fun! Yeah, thanks for ruining it. God. I'm Mama Key, and I have to make sure he does his 30 year old responsibilities. We're like, we're like evil stepmother, Key. He'll be a 30 nothing. <laughs> oh. What? 3 0. That's 3 nothing. That's not 30 nothing, though, because that's 3 0, not 30 now, 0. If that... someone donates $5 to Brett, I'll let him go for another till 7 o'clock. <laughs> well, uh, chat? <clears throat> How about that? Naughty? <laughs> I don't. Selling out. <laughs> old man keyframe hates fun, yet yeah, no fun's allowed. Old man keyframe. <laughs> <laughs> you're an old man. You're an old man. Sorry. Uh, me, we're gonna get you know, my city wall. I keep forgetting that I thought you streamed earlier. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> And you know what? The good, he likes to stay longer. Apparently, you gotta donate. Yeah, now. come on. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta. I could use a little extra give... money for the convention. You gotta give Keyframe her shekels, otherwise, you know, it's not <laughs> happening. <laughs> yeah, five dollars for five more seconds of gameplay. Better bargain than EA. <laughs> okay, well, Every we'll, we'll turn. Um, we'll, tu we'll turn like five dollars into like five minutes. Or, you know what? I'm actually... I'm almost done with this one. Okay, the three pigs. If I... As long as I don't take a hit... Yeah, okay, that as one. As long as I don't suck. Fuck! <laughs> Too bad that's not gonna happen. You can't wait, lose if wait. you win. <clears throat> I, I'm almost done with this guy. 
I say that. Got as this, I... man. There we go. This okay, guy's one a more. chump. They're all chumps. There we go. The three little pigs dead. Uh, I remember I never had the fire flower for these guys, so. I yeah, no, I was a, I was originally doing a fire flower and then um I got hit. That pigs turned into a pig skin. So yeah, um So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and call this an episode and end the stream um end the stream soon. So, hey, think of it that like think of it like this. I have next week off and I could stream <gasps> so many times, even at late like late at night. Hey, what a coincidence. I have four days off of that week. Woohoo! So yeah, how about that, uh, chat? So You know, um, maybe you could buy Dead Life Daily while it's on sale and I can murder you, I mean play with ya. <laughs>